Yes, Chris Tudor here, 2019 European and National Craftlon Champion in my age group. And today I'm going to talk about the Vorgi um, Vortec Swim Goggles. <laughs> First guys, before we start on to the uh, review, please uh, like and subscribe my channel and leave a comment after the video on what you think of the uh, review. So on to the review, um, we're going to talk about the 4G polarised um, Vortec uh, swimming goggles. So, firstly as you can see, I've been using these goggles for quite a while, I've been using them at open water, um, in the pool, um, so I've tested these out for quite quite a while. I haven't been able to race in these yet because um, race season hasn't started. So firstly, what we're going to be looking at is the packaging. It comes in the packaging, so as you can see, it's see-through. It doesn't need to be fancy. It tells you exactly what you want to know. Uh, 4G, Vortec, polarized lens. Uh, lens. Um, so secondly, um, they're quite reasonable. Um, so they're quite uh, affordable. So when you open the packaging, as you can see I'm struggling, but no, it was actually quite easy to open. Um, so as you can see, um, how they come in. So I just leave these over here. And I'll talk about the ones that I've been using. Um, so firstly, what do I think? First impressions, um, I like them. I like uh, big goggles. That I'm not overly keen on the smaller goggles. Um, so firstly, um, impressions are good. Um, I like the uh, polarised lenses. Um, polarised lenses are important for me, especially if I'm swimming in open water and in my races. Uh, it blocks out the sun, so that helps. Now, what I like about these um, goggles is that they are uh, the silicon. Is this is the sort of goggles I I like using constantly. I mean, you get all different types of goggles, but this is the sort of ones where it goes over your eyes, and I, I feel like they're connected and they're stuck um, stuck into my face um, so that it doesn't leak. Uh, so when I put it through to the test, um, there was no leaks there, it was fine. Um, I could see perfectly as well, even in the pool, even the polarised lens, you could see clearly. Um, it was slightly tinted, but that's not a problem. Um, so what I like about them, they do stand out a little bit. Um, I like uh, goggles that stand out. And um, I quite like this red touch here. The only thing I didn't like about this was that the silver bit here, where you um, pull the strap, uh, it was a bit, it looks a bit cheap, but um, maybe the colour needs changing, uh, but it's not a biggie. Um, so so they, they were quite, they were good for swimming, um, well, was it in the pool and outdoors, I, I tested them, no problems with the outdoor, um, in my outdoor sea swims. So they passed that test for me. Now, what I do like about um, these goggles is this strap here, this silicon strap here, for me, is the way, um, is it, for me, is the best strap that I like. I don't like the, um, the other sort of straps you get where you have to fiddle around with it. So this is an easy strap. All you have to do is just literally um, click this here and pull it up and down and it just tightens it. That's how easy it is. So you don't have to fiddle around with the other one. Um, well, I'll do another review of another goggles um, another time, but you'll see that when you do that, it's a bit, um, it's a bit, it's not right. But th this is perfect strap for me. Perfect, it's easy. And especially in races, um, you can just put it out. Just, it's just easy. So um, it's easy to put on. Uh, so the next thing is that um, with it is um, an ultra vision uh, lens, so you, sh you can see further distance. So it's meant to be enhanced, um, so it could be clearer. Um, no problems with that for me. Like as I said, tested it out in um, open water, especially in the sea, and I can see clearly when I'm sighting. Uh, the only problem is I haven't been able to test it in races because race season hasn't been on yet. Um, so looking forward to testing these in races and this will be my um, race goggle for my triathlons. Um, so I think it's quite, it's quite robust. Um, I think it will last 
quite a while by the looks of it, so um, there won't be any problems leaking. Um, as you see, I've done thousands of meters in this um, training wise, and it's it's um, lasted quite long, and um, yeah, it's lasted the test. Now, yeah, there's another thing I, I didn't really like is also is um, the only problem is is these here like uh, it's plastic um, and it's it's clear maybe a different colour plastic and um, maybe um, maybe it can just be used as a rubber material for future so it makes it a little bit lighter and maybe it looks better but these are a nice goggle to use um, I highly recommend them. Um, yeah, so and I did a review a while back we're in on my blog and I should drop the link um, into um, the description of this video. So for me, this is what I'm going to be using in my races. Um, I like it and um, it's perfect for me. So, so um, yeah, I recommend these. So finally, um, thanks for watching and um, please leave a like and comment and subscribe to the channel. Thanks again. And the uh, champions of the disabled uh, category, Henrietta Tarasevich, Emiliano Cristodoro, Kim Chibis, Cristodoro.